guys, it's me. It's Constance with Charming Cousin Crafts here on YouTube and in Facebook. And if you're on my Facebook page, then you've already seen this, but I didn't describe it to you. I said I was going to do a video for you guys on YouTube. Um, obviously, you guys haven't seen this, so this is the first time you guys are going to see this. I'm kind of enjoying my counters to display this stuff because my craft room looks like Christmas uh, barfed. Um, anyway, so if you guys have been watching a lot of YouTube videos, there's a lot of these signs at the Dollar Tree this year that people have been having a great time with. And I thought, well, I'm going to have a little bit of fun myself with them. So here are these like dollar uh, signs that they had. So I thought, well, I'm going to go and I'm going to look and see what I can find. So I went and grabbed a bunch of them. Now I literally grabbed a bunch for this year, next year and whenever. Um, so I spent like a hundred and some dollars on a whole bunch of stuff and you guys are going to get a chance to see some of my other things. Um, so, um, I got a big video coming. I got a how to video coming. Um, and I will be doing that later on cause it's like really early in the morning. Um, I'm like 3:48, and like yesterday I was doing live videos on uh, the Facebook page and I still need to go back and do some more live videos. So, if you're on my YouTube account, you guys need to get on my Facebook account because I am doing live videos on both sides. Um, so, anyway, these are a dollar, and I don't know if there's any left, but these things are amazing to have fun with. Um, and I had Red Flyer um, um, sleds when I was a kid. We didn't have the plastic stuff, and I'm not that old, so don't think that I am. But, anyway, I, I love this, and they had different print ones, but people... These are great. So I went and I got me a new um, sander block. And I went and I scrubbed down the um, the foil off the best that I could on the, the little boots on Santa. And on the nose on Rudolph. And then on the hat, the foil hat. And then, of course, all the glitter. Um, you have to sand it all off. And, of course, I took off the twine. I have plenty of twine, but I like the ribbon better. It's a little more sturdier. Now, they are, for me, growing up, it was a red flyer um, type of, it's a kitty kitty. Justin has put on weight, so Stephanie, the old vet, would be very, very happy. Um, so, Mickey, Mickey's probably want to eat, so I'm going to have to hurry because he's going to want, don't eat my tape. <laughs> Leave the tape. Leave it. Leave it. So anyway, here is the cheap version. This is the dollar version. So I scrubbed it all off. This is just a basic little board. So this is just cheap board. Now you can get the, like, the wet stuff, the wet look stuff, and spray it when you're done. You can get it on Amazon. Great stuff. So when if you put it outside, it will retain the water off. And uh, granted, it's not going to take a waterfall monsoon look or throwing it in a pool. Um, so you know, for the spray stuff after you finish and complete it. Now me, I went with more of like the red flyer type um, sled. So this is what I ended up doing. I ended up going to Walmart. Now they also had ornaments that you could do like the little uh, red car, uh, red truck you can do. But I went to Walmart and I got me some ornaments. So I painted it like the red flyer uh, with the red back, uh, red metal. I used a, just a, a gross green ribbon up at the top rather than twine because it's a little thicker, a little sturdier. And this ornament was like $1.88. I think they still had some because I had the belt on it and then the choo-choo train. And I made this for my mother because my mother loves trains. Um, but this is Snowtex. Um, and again, I painted the whole thing. To, and I did that to make it heavier and thicker. Um, and believe it or not, paint will help make it thicker. Um, you got to make sure that you don't leave it in, uh, on too long. Don't make it really, really wet too quickly because otherwise it will bow the board. And I say that only because I was an art teacher and because I do a lot of painting. Um, now, you guys don't know that I do a lot of painting because I don't always show you all my painting. And I used to do a lot of painting um, way before I did videos because um, I, was a I owned a ceramic shop. Um, so I do know that by using silk, and um, different types of polymers and different types of mediums that you have to be very careful with doing so much paint at one time. So I was doing different layers at different times. So I put two layers of paint on this, especially to cover the front of this. 
So I took my time, and of course, you haven't seen all my projects yet. I am working on it, and much as you guys think on my Facebook page, you have not seen all my projects yet. I am trying to push them out as quickly as I can, but I was working on different projects as I was doing these things. So you guys are going to get to see a lot of my projects, and I have some sitting over here I haven't even shared yet, so I'm dying to show you guys everything. So I'm pushing as quickly as I can, as much as I can, as well as clean up my house, because I want to show you um, what I can of my house. Uh, because I got my barn doors installed on Thursday, and they were supposed to be installed last Sunday. Um, so anyway, that's why I was pushing, trying to get everything done, and I didn't get my ceiling painted. So, And I don't have all my Christmas stuff out this year. I did get three new trees, because a lot of my trees were old and decrepitated. But um, yeah, and I'm not even going to go. I started doing my yard, my yard video, and it is not by any means my favorite yard, but we ended up winning in the neighborhood. It's hilarious. Um, and I didn't even try, try, <laughs> and we still won. It's so sad. I mean, it's wait until next year. Oh, that's all I could say to Country Ben. This is my baseline. <laughs> I'm not even going to go there. It's hilarious. Anyway, so I love snow text. Um, snow text has stucco in it. That's how it gives that thicker dimension to it. Stucco is, um, a cement type of cement. Um, but I added glitter to it, and I used a Lean's Quick Dry Gloss uh, covering, so that's how it works. Now, these beads are from a, um, a, a stick pick that I got from um, Hobby Lobby, and I added them in this because this piece didn't have any of these extra pieces, but I like an even Steven type thing. It's a military wife of me. I am a retired military wife now, which makes me feel old. But 26 and a half years as a military wife earns me that stripes. I, I earn my stripes and my time. But I'm an even Steven girl. But I did end up putting a little bit of snow text in there and I like my beads. Um, and I added some extra little sprays and I put these beautiful little leaves behind it um, and joy. And my mom brings me lots of joys and train brings her joy trains do they always did my uncle used to own um you guys know lionel uh he owned right away industries um michael jackson was one of his biggest uh customers <laughs> and so my mom knew michael jackson uh, quite well so um it's kind of creepy <laughs> that she knew so many she knows a lot more celebrities it's just they were lionel and right away were cadet competitors but um yeah, eventually when I get everything done, uh, I think that I will probably go to my mom. She probably still has a lot of train stuff left. And at Christmas, you'll probably see eventually that I put trains around the house. And I'll have choo-choos running around the house. So I'm sure, <laughs> Justin, I'm sure you'll enjoy seeing trains eventually. And if you guys ever wonder how I ended up learning how to do a lot of my landscaping and stuff. And you guys haven't even seen my landscaping. I, what is your beef? <laughs> You're going to poke at me? You are not in the Christmas spirit. Bah humbug. Whoop! Smack at me, brat. Bah humbug. Oh, no. You're going to love on me. Oh, lover boy. I gave you food. No. No. Why are you biting me? Oh, you got to bite and then suck, uh, suck and then lick. Don't you give me that look. What the heck? Why are you biting on me? What's you biting on me for? What's your beef? What's your beef, buddy? Wow. What's wrong? What's your beef? I just gave you chicken. Play with your mousey. What's your mouse? What's your mouse? Play with your mouse. Boy, he got to stick up his butt. Hmm? Play with, okay, you play, there you go. There's a good boy. Boy, he's got to stick up his butt. There, what's wrong with you? He's a good boy. Am I not giving you enough love? Justin. He's your ball humbuggy. See, he's your ball humbuggy. Lover boy. My little buddy. Oh, wow. 
Boy, see, he got some weight on him. He's gotten fat. By telling him, you got fat. Boy. Love her, boy. Anyway, so this piece, if you can find it, does not come with any of this on the side. Does not come with the snow text. I put all the snow text to it. If you can see all this, none of that comes on there. And I put the snow text up at the top, like it had snowed down on the sled. And this has like the fuzzy stuff on the side. I put a little of the snow text on the side. A little extra berries here. I put a little snow text here. And I did run the snow text up underneath the, the wheels. And I put it around the sides. If you guys have never been on a train, it's not all that exciting. Um, I've been on trains many, many times. My uncle actually was part owner in one as well. He wasn't just a, a hobby train owner company. He actually was part owner, him and a buddy of his. So I did it to where it was speed across the top like the snow was coming down and beating down this way. Because the train goes this way, right? When it goes, the snow goes this way. When the train goes that way. So I used to be, when I did my uncle, when I worked for my uncle, I started working for him doing letters. And then I eventually worked my way into landscaping on the, the big platforms and doing landscaping and doing their, you know, their layouts. And then I ended up doing the electronics and the boards and, and their trains. So um, this is how I ended up doing a lot of different things. So I really should do some sort of layout stuff like that, but I don't really have a reason to. Um, when I got into high school and I had to do more of science fair type stuff, yeah, I, nobody could beat me. Because <laughs> I already had all this stuff, and you couldn't find that stuff anywhere. And that stuff in a bag used to be up to $200 a bag because it's a very particular type of rubber. Nowadays, it's a lot more accessible back then it wasn't. Um, but I always had my excess to it because I had an uncle that sold it. But anyway, I think it came out super cute. I mean, I made sure that I even got some down up on. And this is a real little leather little belt, which I thought was really cute. Or a pleather belt, not a real little leather, but a pleather belt. A leather looking belt, I should say. And I made sure I got some snow text down in there. Like, it had really snowed down into there. And I got some down into there. But um, I did not apply the Adeline's Glossy Back to the back. I wanted to, and my husband's like, mm, no, I wouldn't do it. But it just kind of reminded me as a kid, and I just put a couple little lines in it. I almost left it flat. You don't do it to the top up here if you guys have never had a sled. If you're in the south and you've never gone sled riding, this board piece up here is one solid piece. So don't put lines in it, okay? So just so you know that, don't put lines in it. It's one solid piece. And I say that because I used to own one. And um, these board these board pieces are actually very, very sharp underneath. It's And you have to keep them waxed. Um, but anyway, that is my joy board. My Christmas joy board for my mom. From that to that. And it cost me... A dollar eighty-eight and dollar eighty-eight and a whole buck from Dollar Tree. So less than five bucks, but if you count taxes, because I had everything else, you know. Um, but yeah. I don't know, I guess not, because I guess I, I got this from Hobby Lobby. So and this was part of the Hobby Lobby, the berries are mine. I guess maybe it probably cost me seven dollars. Six, seven dollars. What I just I don't know, six, seven dollars. Six dollars, seven dollars, if you want to count it that way. I don't know, but anyway, that is my snowboard, uh, or sleigh, joy sleigh, joy sleigh sign, <laughs> train fly. But there you go, and it goes from that little cheap board to that for my mom. It's a little surprise present that I didn't tell her about, and I hope she likes it. I think she will. All right, there you go. Bye, guys.